Oh, honey, I'm so sorry. Here's what I think happened. If I use my Omega-trained spy critical thinking skills, you forgot to make a reservation, so you couldn't get us in anywhere. So you decided to make roast because you like roast, and we all nearly escaped death from E. coli. I made mashed potatoes. In this luxury villa, might that be the leaky timeshare that Luther is always trying to pawn off on us? I will pack the extra towels. I'm sorry. I'm really, really sorry. I just got used to give managing all this stuff. <laughs> you don't think I figured that out? And by manage everything, do you mean do everything? Because two days after our anniversary, you got me lilac-scented perfume. I didn't know you were allergic. Could it hide? I know, I know. You like the stuff that Gib gets you better. I get it. It's not about what Gib got. It's not about the Gib gifts. It's not about the stuff, Harry. I'm even over the fact that you lied to me for 17 years. All of those memories of the birthdays, the anniversary, they meant something to me. I thought that behind every single one of those special moments was a husband who cared. Not Gib with a database of things Helen likes and isn't allergic to. Honey, I do care. I love you. My heart's in the right place. I just got used to delegating all this stuff to Gib because he's really good at it, and you really liked it. You were happy. Delegating love? Ugh. Come on, Harry. It matters whether or not it's you. You can dress up a lie, but still just a lie.